The regular season finale at the Allen County War Memorial Coliseum, the Fort Wayne Maddens going for the 14th win, and Dakota hoping that they could win the Eastern Conference outright. But Vernon Macklett on that rim record had something to say about it after a great feed from Thomas Baudinet, and that was the beginning of an indication that it was going to be a challenging night. Garcia downstairs on a great feed from Ron Howard, scores on the chin-up, but that wasn't all for Garcia. He has been playing so well as of late. A great effort there. The Mad Ants somehow get the ball. A great steal and get it out of heavy traffic. Torrey Jackson, watch on the right now. Garcia comes in and flies the high trapeze. Now the Mad Ants toss it in. The old rule is watch the guy who threw it in. And there he is. Ron Howard gets the screen from Lazar and hits the jump shot. The key came late in the ball game. Cam Jones knocks the ball away from Maurice Baker, gets a return frame from Stephen Graham, scores a huge basket for the Mad Ants there, and is able to pull the team up even. Then we had a controversial jump ball right near the end of the ball game, and the ball was actually caught by Edwin Ugly's conversation about it, but the ball was given to the Mad Ants. However... In this topsy-turvy game, this wasn't the end of it. The ball was stolen as Ron Howard ran out of time. Dakota was able to steal it, but time was running out for the Mad Ants. Hannah, against three men, tried to force a shot, could not get it up. And that was the end of the ball game. The Mad Ants hung on for a 99-98 victory. Bill Hazen, Fort Wayne.